السلام عليكم ورحمة الله and welcome to this tutorial about installing open form on Ubuntu shell first as you know open form can't be installed directly on windows it can be only installed on linux the problem with installing open form on linux is that it's difficult for students to replace their windows systems with linux systems or even running windows in parallel with Ubuntu on the same machine so we use this Ubuntu shell Ubuntu is a version of Linux and the Ubuntu shell is some kind of interface for a virtual system that can be built within the Windows system. In this tutorial, we will start with installing the Ubuntu shell itself, then installing OpenFOAM, the last version, trying a test case and installing the post-processing Paraview package. So let's start with installing Ubuntu shell. In Windows 10, you can find the Ubuntu shell in the Microsoft Store. Go to the Start menu, look for Microsoft Store, then search for Ubuntu. You will find a few releases. Take the latest one and click Get to start the download. After the installation completes, you will find this button launch now the installation starts and it will take almost half an hour after completing the installation the shell will ask you for a username and password for the ubuntu shell you can select a username and password which are different from those for windows then you are done the final step in the installation is to ask windows to accept the shell how to do that from the windows powershell again start menu windows powershell then this windows powershell right click run as administrator do you want to allow this app yes this will start a windows terminal and add this command to the powershell and enter done this completes the installation of the ubuntu shell the next step is to install a open form you can install open form the latest release from the official website which offers you a few steps to install open form open your ubuntu shell from the start menu and start copying these commands one by one at the first time it will ask for the password because the first word is sudo which means administrator or root which is necessary for installing software in ubuntu and afterwards the strips are straightforward to find the installed version of open form go to pc c users your username view hidden items app data local packages and canonical group limited this is the installed ubuntu go to local state and root fs you will find your open form at home your Ubuntu username and that's it the final step in the installation is to edit environmental variables which means introducing open form shortcuts to Ubuntu this is done from the .pshrc file right click open with note bad take a note never to edit Ubuntu files using other than note bad the file will be corrupted if it is an open form file, the case will be damaged. And if it is an Ubuntu file, the whole system will be damaged. So edit using notepad. Go to the end of the file and add this line, which I got from the website. Save, close, restart Ubuntu again. Try this, simple form, help. 
very very nice ubuntu can realize open form release 8 this means the installation is complete now let's try this test case to check if the open form installation was successful open an, a new ubuntu shell and copy this command make a directory for your own cases change directory to this directory you are now in the run folder or directory copy a test case called its daily go through it we are within the test case right now build the mesh very nice run the solver you can check the case from here it's solving and getting results and done you have just solved your first case and you can run the post processing software paraview if you try to run the paraview from ubuntu probably it will not run because as i think the ubuntu shell doesn't allow user interface within the windows system so you have to download the post processing software paraview from the website for the native windows system here the website you will find a few paraview packages you can choose the most suitable for your system the version you download from paraview is a portable version that means to run it you have to extract it and run it directly from the installation folder a few then this is the icon dot exe you can make a shortcut on the desktop like me and run this is part of you to open your test case go to file open go to the case copy the location navigate then then what where is the file to pick actually this file you have to create go to the place make a new empty text file which will be called it's daily and the extension will be home yes again we'll find this file okay and here you have your backstep flow test case this completes our tutorial about installing open form in an open to shell hope this was useful for you and see you okay inshallah assalamu alaikum